time. Wherever on the card where they're booked, I don't care if they're in that ring, we're coming in after them. This ain't it. What do you say now? <laughs> if there's any way I can get that man's mask, I don't know who it is, but the next time I'm with him, the people are going to know uh, as long as I'm in uh, there. In other words, you ought to bloody him up just like you've been bloodied That's up. That's right, if not worse. Any way I can get back in him, I'm going to do it. Well, good luck to you, and uh, I hope you get a chance to him right away. But you're cut pretty bad up there. What did you run into, the ring post? Yes, yeah, so the ring post and the uh, concrete. Like I said, it's not done every night, and it's not going to happen again. I can well, guarantee you. I hope you both wish you both good luck. That's right, especially that Rick Sanchez for using that chair. Naturally, they don't use that chair, and he come in and use that chair on him. That same thing's going to happen to them when we get them back. Well, I see that one of you hit Rick Sanchez, Sanchez with a chair because That's his right. head busted up. Trying to give him just a little bit what happened. Well, good luck to both of you boys. All right, thank you. Thank you very much. in Louisville, Kentucky are ready for action tonight as the Sheik from Syria makes his debut here in the Louisville, Kentucky area. He'll be going against the fabulous Jackie Fargo from Memphis, Tennessee. This is our main event of the evening and this promises to be an outstanding match here tonight at Louisville's Convention Center. The fans are on their feet. In comes the very popular Jackie Fargo. And the Sheik is ready for him. And we're wasting no time, fans, and away we go. The Sheik takes off his hood, starts laying in a Jackie Fargo, biting and clawing, and Jackie Fargo hadn't even got his jacket off yet. And the fans are on their feet, Tommy Marlin, the referee, is trying to break it up. However, he just lets the bell ring, and away we go. This is one hour time limit, and one fall, the Sheik versus Jackie Fargo in Louisville, Kentucky. Tommy Marlin, the referee, is going to have his hands full tonight. Jackie Fargo takes a fist to the head, and he is mad. Jackie Fargo is mad and has taken a beating already. The Sheik, it looks like he has some sort of foreign object. The Sheik looks like he's, he has, he has an object digging in at Jackie Fargo's head. Jackie Fargo is mad. Jackie Fargo is pleading. Jackie Fargo is getting ready to grab to the Sheik. This is going to be one of the wildest matches ever seen in Louisville tonight. The Sheik rams Jackie Fargo on the head with that object. And again, Jackie Fargo onto the floor. Blood already pouring from his forehead. Referee Tommy Marlin is going to check the Sheik to see if there's any foreign object. But as the referee looks at the Sheik's hands, he finds no foreign object. Jackie Fargo covered with blood already. We've just begun this match. This is one fall with a one hour time limit. And here we go again. One more time, the Sheik continues to go at the head of Jackie Fargo. Two of the five of the best wrestlers in our country in this ring tonight in Louisville, Kentucky. Jackie Fargo takes another one to the head. The referee warns the Sheik. The Sheik doesn't speak English. There's definitely going to be a communication problem there because the Sheik from Syria does not speak English. Swings Jackie Fargo, that was after the Sheik just saw that object fly. Jackie Fargo picks up that foreign object and lays into the Sheik. Jackie Fargo now has that foreign object and is digging into the Sheik's head and pounds the Sheik. Jackie Fargo, unbelievably mad. That blood pouring down his face, he lays into the Sheik. The Sheik may be bleeding, I can't tell from here. The Sheik is bleeding. Both wrestlers bleeding from the head. Jackie Fargo pounds the Sheik. The Sheik with blood in his eyes can't see where, can't even see Jackie Fargo. Have you ever seen anything like that, fans? The Sheik is dazed. His head is bleeding, Jackie Fargo's head is bleeding. Jackie Fargo, loaded for bear, continues to pound those fists into the head of the Sheik. Now the Sheik taking a tremendous beating from Jackie Fargo. What a match this 
this is turning out to be. It looks like a sheik, a sheik eating paper. Is out, the, the sheik is eating paper for some reason. Jackie Fargo batters away at the sheik. Well, the blood is flowing in that ring tonight. Referee Tommy Marlin trying to break the two wrestlers up. That is almost like a mountain against a molehill. Will you look at that, fans? The referee can't get the wrestlers apart. Jackie Fargo wants to pulverize the Sheik. Right now, it looks like he's done it. The Sheik comes back at Jackie Fargo. Both wrestlers are extremely strong, extremely tough, and very, very skilled. Exchanging punches in the ring to the head. Jackie Fargo giving it all he's got into the Sheik. Referee Tommy Marley getting choked on that rope. Jackie Fargo continues to open up that wound on the Sheik's head. The bell is ringing, fans. The bell is ringing. Apparently, the referee has had the bell rung. We'll have to wait and see what kind of decision has been made. The, the wrestlers continue. And the Sheik, the Sheik, pulled out that fireball right into the eyes of the referee, Tommy Marlin. I've never seen anything like this. Tommy Marlin got fire in the face. He is blinded temporarily, at least. Jackie Fargo is going after the Sheik, the Sheik out of the ring. The referee had that fire shot right in his eyes by the Sheik. What an unbelievable match. I've never seen anything like this. The match lasted about four minutes to